Hello and welcome to EMS for SOLIDWORKS Tips and Tricks. Today we will look at the two types of forces that are there in EMS. We have the Lorentz force and the virtual work. First let us take a look at the Lorentz force. For example, we have a voice coil actuator where there is a copper conductor which is placed inside a magnetic field. To calculate the force on a current carrying conductor, we use Lorentz force in EMS. So for example, we will to calculate the force on the copper conductor, we are going to use the Lorentz force. Next, let us take a look at another type of force called virtual work. This is an example of a rotational actuator where the inner core material highlighted is made of a ferromagnetic material namely 1008 steel. To calculate the force acting on the ferromagnetic material due to the excitations of the coil we will use what is called as virtual work. For example, we can use the virtual work to compute the force and the torque acting on the rotating core. To recap, if you are having a current carrying conductor in a magnetic field and you would like to compute the force on the conductor, then you use Lorentz force. On the other hand, if you are having a ferromagnetic material in a magnetic field and you would like to compute the force or torque acting on the ferromagnetic material, we use virtual work. If you have permanent magnets and you want to compute the force acting on them, we also use virtual work in this case. Thank you for watching this video.